Okay, so the important part of the skip happens at Marine Aeronautics um, and also the, what has to do with fast travel and so on. So I'll focus on that and not clip for the rest of the level. So, I mean, I'll do a full level run soon, so if there's any problem, I'll say, but I really don't think there will. So you, yes, you get to the checkpoint normally, and then from here on, what you do is you do skip like Bowser did for any percent. So you come and do this part. Oh, that was a bad grenade. Then you do the actual skip, which is fucking annoying. I still get it wrong very often. So it's about here, and then... Let's see, I fucked it up. I mean, I didn't fuck it up, but I need to try again. Okay, I got it. Okay, so you ignore these guys, you don't care about them. Now the problem is, right now, my fast travel is locked. So if I get to the fin end of the level, then I can't come back here. And if I go down and trigger any of the fights around here, then I get orange walls and I can't continue. So what I want to do instead is come to this staircase from the top, not from the bottom. Because if I come from the bottom, I spawn the revenant and I uh, spawn an orange wall on the top. So I want to come from the top and then go like between five and seven steps down around here. So what I'm doing here is hitting a trigger that will unlock fast travel later without spawning the revenant. It's important to do this, very important because otherwise you can't come back. Don't go farther down because you'll spawn the revenant, but don't go to, don't stay too far up because you'll keep fast, tra fast travel locked. And you want to make, you, you can't even check if you have fast travel unlocked here. I did it this by doing it in a different order, and that's how I learned that the trigger was here. But you gotta be careful. So you do this, make sure you've unlocked it, and then you continue. You, you see, there's no orange walls here, there's no enemies spawning, there's nothing. So I can continue, go all the way. I can go all the way here, I can trigger the lift. I won't, I won't trigger the lift because then I will, I will spawn stuff at Marius, but you get all the way here. Now you do the rest of the level, which I'm gonna skip with uh, fast travel. Or at least, I mean, maybe not the rest of the entire level, but at least, I mean, I don't know which fast travel order might be the best yet. I haven't thought of that. But you get to the Marauder, basically. Now, when you get to the Marauder, hold on. I'm lazy. So you get to the Marauder, you kill the Marauder, and then you get fast travel. And if you've done it right, then you have fast travel. But you need to do the thing on the search to, to have fast travel here, otherwise you get it locked here and you can't do anything. And now you can go to Arcturus and do those things, or at some point you want to go back to Marine Aeronautics, which conveniently leaves you exactly at the right spot. Uh, as you see, the, um, the monkey bus and the and the soldiers have this despawned, but that's fine. Then I just need to go back until I hear sounds. See, now, now they're spawned. Now I just kill them. I'm gonna do this with the BFV, but I've tried without the BFV to make sure it's not dependent on uh, enemies that are not in range. And you do this, and once you've killed everything, so you can do this, it's not, the BFV is not killing anything that's not killable. I've tried this without the BFV, I just didn't want to do this. And I've gotten the, the point, and I have fast travel, and I can fast travel back to the end. And what I've saved here, what I've what I've uh, avoided doing here, is well, first part of the demons that spawn here, so the monkeys and the soldiers that spawn in the beginning. I think some other soldiers as well. I'm not sure, uh, but mostly the entire fucking stir, like oh, the two revenants that spawn in the stir, the hell knight, and all that fodder that spawns in the stir, which takes a good maybe 40 seconds, one minute. I've saved that, so that's good, and I've taken maybe. I don't know, 15, I, I, I'm, I'm just talking out, out of my ass, but maybe 15, 20 seconds on doing the skips. Uh, so I, I'd, think, I'd say it's a pretty solid uh, time save. You also, I think I haven't decided on the specific route yet, but I think I'm probably, when I do the skip, right after doing the skip, I'm gonna do the um, secret encounter before continuing. But I'm not sure, I haven't thought about that. So there it is.